you missed it. Okay. <laughs> now we got something loud coming. That's not good. What do you think of that? It was amazing! Yeah! Welcome back to the Ford Festiva project car, Ashley's special project. And this is episode 8. We're going to try to tackle this right here. This is the ceiling of the car. In the previous video, we removed the headliner. Now it's not in bad shape, but it's vinyl covered and it's painted blue. So what's your plan? Well, at first my plan was to just paint it black, but then I was thinking, eh, that's not going to look that good. So now my plan is to put fabric on it. So we're going to be trying to do that in this video, see how we do refurbishing, renewing the old headliner. Before we put fabric on it, I'm going to reinforce it because we have some weak spots. This is ripped here. It's, it's worse than it looks. Yeah, it's just... It's broken. Ripped. There's a couple of, there's a couple of breaks in it. here, 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 and I think on that side there's, there's this side feels pretty good. Is it? It's all on that one side and this back right here it's kind of cracking. Yeah, we don't want any weak spots. So we're gonna make sure this is flat and tight, and we're gonna reinforce it with a fiberglass mesh. We're gonna use fiberglass resin with fiberglass mat. I, I probably will only need one layer of this mesh because we're not going for super rigidity. We just want to keep it from coming apart. It's just a patch to glue it together. Yep. Now we just cover it up. I feel like Bob Ross here. Mm -hmm. Happy little clouds. <laughs> I 
It sounds like it. Doesn't it? Mm-hmm. It's the next day. The fiberglass is dry, very hard, and it fixed the problem. This thing isn't crackling anymore. So that solved that. We also reinforced these cracks. There's no flex to this at all. But we didn't expect it to do this. For some reason, the fiberglass resin caused wrinkling on the back side. The front side, I should say, of our ceiling. Yeah, but it won't matter anyway since we're covering it with a thicker type fabric. So we went to the fabric store, looked all around, and this is the one I ended up going with. It has a little bit of stretch to it, kind of thicker but not too thick. It's soft. It's like a little fuzzy type material. This is what the back looks like. We're gonna be trying this Loctite spray adhesive. This is a heavy duty adhesive, it should work. We're not really sure, so it's gonna be an experiment. Uh, it does say not recommended for headliners, but since we're doing a different type of situation here, we're gonna try it and I think it'll be okay. Yeah, and on here it says it's good for upholstery, van motorhome conversions, marine applications, Ooh, that goes on weird. Is that normal? Yeah. Okay, it's like weird. I wasn't expecting that. Guys, I was not expecting spider webs. That's bizarre. So, I don't know what it, how aggressive it is for grab, so we'll just try to keep it smooth. Okay, so the process went really well, and this turned out really good. Kidding. <laughs> we, we made a mistake. This stuff was a failure, it did not work. So. And we'll show you why. Right now, go ahead. It just peels off like. Nothing. Easy. Easy peasy. I don't know if we waited just too long and the glue dried or if it's just not the right glue for this situation.
Okay. At least we have enough to do a second go. We happen to have extra fabric for just an occasion as this. <laughs> so we're going to start over because the other fabric has so much of that webby glue on the back that it's not worth trying to re-glue it. Yeah. There's too much in the way to make it maybe not glue good the second time. We happen to have another adhesive here. We're going to try this even though it's the same brand. This one has a different spray, different glue. It says fabric. We tested a little piece of fabric outside on something else and it seemed to work a lot better. So hopefully it works better on here. Wow, that's a lot of overspray. Do you want to, well, do you want to take this outside? Why is it doing it like that? Let's take this outside before we... Oh, this is a disaster. Do you see anything? No. Want to try it? Yeah. Lay down. a new layer of I'm getting wrinkles and we'll fold them under okay yeah. hopefully this is okay uh, we will likely need the scissors and that's where I started That's it. Um. No. Oh. Ouch. Let me go this way. Oh, we gotta do these sides quick or else it's gonna dry. That's right. They're all drying. Just hang on. It just feels completely dry now. No, no, no. Sorry. Bell's over there still trying to scheme a way to go to Chipotle. She's thinking. Maybe I could go in and Maybe order. I could order. You know oh. how it goes. I think this is coming out okay. I'm gonna flip it over and see Hope. how it looks. Cool. I don't see it bubbling up anywhere. Yeah, this glue is a lot better than the other stuff. All right. Mm -hmm. Hey, Belle. And you can yes. spell things on it. Can you, um... It's so soft, you can't stop touching it. <laughs> right? Mm hmm Now we still have to poke some holes in it where the yeah. stuff goes through. We'll do that later. And we also need to buy the... I'll just cut it generally to the shape for you. All it really needs to be is enough for the wires and stuff to go through. Okay. That's good then. We'll figure it out when we get there. Yeah. All right. Ugh, that was awkward. Should we have the car in the background? Sure. So that didn't go exactly as we planned. No. But it's done. We hope. Yeah. Hopefully there's not a third time that we have to do. We'll see. But um, that second glue worked a lot better than the first one. If this glue doesn't hold, if we have problems and the 
falls apart and it sags over time, we could always pull the headliner and try a headliner adhesive and just see how that works. Or try something completely different. There's, I don't know. There's always other products. Uh, luckily, the fabric wasn't super expensive and it's a learning experience, so whatever. Unfortunately, we're not going to get it installed in this video because we're not ready for that. We're going to let the glue set up and also we need to find some new plastic clips that hold it in place. Mm -hmm. And we're just not ready, but piece by piece, the car is coming together. We're getting together. these things ready to be installed, like the dashboard, the headliner. And we're kind of slacking on the dashboard. It's still sitting, waiting to be installed. We're not held up by anything other than time. We want to clean out the car good and... We just have to get to these things. Yeah, and we've been so busy lately that we haven't had a lot of time to put toward the car. But I hope you guys enjoyed the update anyway and watching us tackle another project. We should have another video next Sunday, so keep a lookout for that. And until next time, take care. See ya.